My stage name is A to the Z to the A A A Azar. Um, Azar is an Arabic word. Uh, it stands for courage and a lot of other goodies. But basically, it's a name that depicts my personality, who I am. My creative process mm, depends on what I'm trying to achieve. Sometimes I hear a good beat and I like it. I just vibe to it, write whatever, and then much later I'll work on it. Sometimes I create a particular song for weeks and even years. I have a song I wrote for like five years consistently. I kept changing it until I felt it was right. And then I recorded it. Mm. Some other times I get like, I get this vibe in my head and I go to the producer and say, okay, this is what I want to achieve. Let's do this. And he brings his own suggestions. I bring what I want and we meet at the middle, you know, and get that particular song or that particular track done. So it's not a straightforward thing. It's just anyhow editing go. I function best when I'm singing, whether it's behind the microphone or when I'm performing live, especially when I'm performing live because, I mean, every time I sing, even if it's the same song a thousand times, I get to do it differently. There are no two performances that are the same and that's one thing that amazes me. So I think I function best in the performance department, the songwriting, uh, the recording, mm, but the performance. That's where the magic is. The magic. The easiest part of the job. Hmm. There's no part of the job that is actually easy. They all have their difficulties. I would say the easiest part of the job for me is still the performance. I'm still singing it. Because after all the rishi rishi, writing, recording, you know, going for fittings and looking good. The end product is what I'm interested in. I want to go there and give my fans or give my audience, my listeners, the best experience of their life. And it comes naturally to me. So that's the easy. Singing is the easiest. Right? The hardest is the songwriting process. Because when you're writing a song, yes, you want to write what comes to your mind. But this is Africa. You have to put your uh, listeners into the, the picture. You have to put your listeners into the picture. So if you write a song for yourself, you still have to make it sound a w in a way that people would want to listen and buy it. And me, most of the times, I'm, I'm stringent. If I like a particular thing and I maybe a song comes to my mind, if my manager says, no, do it like this, I will still be tilting towards that point. I already made up my mind I want to do. So. That's difficult for me, having to adjust so that I can give my listeners the best. It's a difficult process for me. What keeps me going? Um, when I feel down or discouraged, I go to you know YouTube or maybe Google and check out artists or those that have come before me. I go through their bio, see the difficulties they pass through, watch their interviews and tell myself, if these people did it, I can do it. And I feel like that's the same thing I want to do for others that are coming after me. They should be able to look at me and say, if she did it, I can do it too. So that's how I encourage myself. Sometimes I pray, some other times I cry, cry and come out and maintain beauty, you know? But at the end of it all, I just find a way to encourage myself. Okay. Hmm. Uh, eh, no. <laughs> it's, it's not like I don't know it though. Okay, I don't know it. Okay. See, first of all, let's get this right. Um, we have a minister for aviation. I know. There's somebody fulfilling that seat. 
Someone is sitting down there. I just don't really know the exact person at the moment who is sitting there. It's hard. It's time consuming, money consuming. You will cry, you will laugh, you will feel like, you know, you do remember. And then some days you ask God why. It's, you go through a range of emotions, but if you really want to make it work, then you have to understand that it's a process. And there's a light at the end of the tunnel. Even the majority of the times you might not see it. You just to keep pushing. Me, I'm still pushing. So I cannot tell you anything that is not keep pushing. All of us will push. Let's all be pushing and be going. Keep pushing. Yes. I'm going to do a line of the song I recently released. It's titled Life. It's off my EP, Lifeline. Mm. You put a wound over my eyes. I can't believe that you were lying to me. But now I know. I'm not letting you get the best of me, oh no, oh no, oh, 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 oh. yeah. You're watching Tab TV. Like, follow, share on all the social media platforms. It's your girl Aza. I'm out. <laughs>